Yeah. Uh, American Truck Simulator Take 12. And action! I wish we knew what remembered our song from earlier. America! <laughs> truck Simulator. Oh, God. <laughs> truck, yeah. Truck, yeah. Freedom is the, the only, only way. truck, yeah. America! <laughs> uh, uh. God, that man. was real loud. It was super loud. <laughs> it was loud. I set my dogs off again. Uh, uh. So, uh, a Jordan. I don't know what that was. I plum don't know who took all this candy here. <laughs> but I can tell you there's gonna be a lot of upset kittens in this here town. No, well, you sound like, what's, 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 the, know. Who what's the old guy in uh, Family Guy Herbert who, the pervert? yeah, watches, uh... <laughs> I, I plum don't know why you're wearing pants, too. So, uh, so, uh, Jordan. Oh, hi, you go, You okay? You're crying there. Yeah, because you sound real <laughs> creepy. And I feel unsafe. <laughs> Hey, uh, Jordan, come in, Jordan. Breaker, breaker. I don't want to. Tom, you there, breaker, breaker? This is this is Monkey Man. Are we really playing this game? Tom, Jordan, Jordan, <laughs> yeah. God damn it. Go on, Keegan. Uh, we're uh, playing American Trucker here. Over. Uh, you guys uh, really, really excited for American Truck Simulator? Kill me. <laughs> <laughs> no, but we're playing American Truck Simulator. Um, really excited to jump in this game. It's a Sims. Simulating sim game that's gotten a lot more attention than most sim games out there. Yeah, uh, other I'm than maybe the for Sims, it. True Sims series. So I'm really excited. I know you're excited. You're not so excited. But uh, this is a game about being a trucker sitting on your butt and hauling gear from point A to point B and not crashing anything and bang all the laws. What's more exciting? Sounds great. <laughs> Did you like say bang on the bang all the laws? Bang all the laws. Well, the way I drive. That law needs a good. Bang. I am in the driver's seat today, just so y'all know. Yeah. So this should be terrifying. real fun. Should be real interesting, but. I'm really excited because I've, I've been playing this game for a little bit now and I like it. So I can't wait to kind of show it off to you guys and show it off to you guys. So without further ado, let's go hop in the driver's seat. Let's get trucking. Let's go. All right. Time to get trucking with our uh, company, uh, Get in the Van LLC, <laughs> which I still think is the best uh, s scary trucking company name. It was it was really just kind of uh, brought about by staring at the gentleman that we are driving as. Yeah, we're uh, we're kind of um, what's what's the name for the, an actor who uh, like Daniel Day Lewis is a, a method, method actor. actor. Yeah, we're kind of method character creators where Whoop. we I just my turn. yeah, and Keegan's driving everyone, so uh, I'm gonna back up. Don't mind me. So uh, that's that's what's going on here. Uh, but yeah, we're very much method character creators. We just look at the screen, and whoever speaks to us the most, uh, that's who we choose. And then we, we kind of create a backstory based off of that. King, that's a nice... Uh, John, John Lennon. John Lennon. Uh, I'm going to skip so we can start a whole new thing here. All right. So yeah, we did a thing. Look, hey, we, we got excellent. excellent. We used 2.1 gallons of fuel, got $262. Got 70 we're, XP. We're a we're newbie. newbie. So this is a game that uh, I've been irrationally excited about. Um, a lot I've, of people have been playing it, which is kind of surprising because yeah. it's look we got a, we got our own. Uh, that's that's real sketchy. That's our, that's our headquarters. <laughs> Let's never upgrade this it. Let's upgrade everything else. Van, so that's so uh, this is our dude here. Um, what's his name? Uh, his name's L2G, I guess technically. I feel like he, I feel like he would be like. I feel like a Henry. I was maybe. about to say Henry. I was Henry. Say Henry or Scott. What's, so this is Henry. He is CEO of uh, Get in the Van LLC, and uh, uh, he has seventeen hundred dollars to his name. One garage, zero trucks. Uh, hey man. And he's the only driver. He buys a lot of hookers and blow. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is a game that I've been kind of excited about watching. Not necessarily because I'm interested in it, because this is not a game I would play. But just because I've been hearing so much. Let's do those home accessories, Ooh, though. I don't know. Pressure tank. I don't care. Home accessories. Home accessories for him would be like his... But it's uh, a short trailer, so it's harder to control. His sex dungeon. <laughs> <sighs> well, fine. I guess we'll do home accessories. Yeah, because he's... from Los Angeles to Fresno. He's got to have his camera for recording all of his sketchy shit. It's not his stuff. He's just delivering it. <laughs> you don't know that's not his stuff. He could have a very lucrative so, uh, side business. Oh, God. Oh, where are you at? I'm inside the building. Oh, no, it's a full trailer. Okay, we're good. So this is our trailer. Oh, this is nice. That's our truck. We got a nice red truck. It looks like it's from Ikea. That's it's what it is. blue and yellow. All right, so, so we've been trying to play this game with a controller. That hasn't been working, so Keegan's doing a uh, mouse and, or just keyboard, really. Um, yeah, so no mouse. I, that, that was the problem, is I was trying to do both mouse and keyboard, and I just could not. This so this will be a testament to uh, Keegan's driving capabilities. So my uh, my arrows are my drive, 
And you can control or configure. I should probably look before I go out there. You can configure. Uh, the old truckers don't look. You can configure. Into configure all all the controls as need be. I don't know. I will. I will say I've been listening to a lot of podcasts that have been talking about this game, and like they've gotten a lot of emails from real truckers, and those guys seem real safe. Uh, like I, I don't learned. Only turn signals. Uh, press 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 everything. I'm Maybe scared to start it. pressing stuff. Well, pre- press escape and look Again, at the key I don't think you're playing this realistically yeah. enough. Truckers uh, don't use is... turn signals. Yeah, they do. Uh, uh, so here, here we go. Let's actually take a look at this. So you have a primary and secondary, so you can set up multiple things for key bindings. Uh, so uh, let's just look to see what... Uh... There's retarder. That's trail break. Retarder? That's, that's retarder. offensive. No, retarder. It, it helps when you go down hills. Trucking yeah. language, guys. Look, we have windshield wipers is P. Cruise control is huh. C. Yep, it's like here. Uh... I would assume it'd be under function. How good's our oh, horn? Left indicator. It's the two brackets. All right, that makes sense. How good's our horn? Was H horn? I'm assuming. I think so. It's not bad. Did you guys, when you were kids, did you ever stand out by the side of the road and if you saw a trucker coming, you would do that kind of like that? The little honk honk. Yeah. Like I thing. I never uh, by did the way, that. I'm, but if I'm I was... turning left, I'm doing signal indication. If so. I was driving by though, or my parents were driving by and I would see one, I would occasionally do it, but. Do a butt. Yeah. But yeah, this game is uh, real peaceful. Um, do you have a radio? I do, but we can't play it because copyright reasons. Do you have a CV? No, not that. Like Break a radio. Breaker one nine. Uh, supposedly, Breaker. they don't really use them that much. Um, they don't. They uh, yeah. That's like it's just thing. something that we've kind of kept from like the nineteen seventies, nineteen eighties movies with like truckers in it, and yeah, truckers don't actually really use the CV radio anymore. It's not. Like, it's like. Whiskey Dick nine seven coming in right now. We got a we got a a popo for show. Three blocks down the road with a. By the way, uh, it's real hard. To, uh, I, that cop just ran a red light. He did. Uh, God damn it! Get him, Keegan. Typical pig. <laughs> Go. F- I'm gonna try to make this turn here. So so I so I saw you get experience points. So do you get experience points then for like proper driving etiquette and yes. like things like that? Okay. Yep, and you lose Correct points for you lose techniques. points for being late, for running into stuff, damaging your trailer, your vehicle. Alright, alright. So all right. later on as you level up, there's different things you're gonna unlock. So like you can unlock larger longer hauls. Uh, I am speeding, I need to keep that in mind, especially because there's a cop right in front of me, so I'm gonna Whatever well, he's in front, he's right he, a red he light. Just cut a fucking red light, fuck that guy. So you're in Los Angeles right now. Yeah. Oh. Whoop. Is it semi <laughs> like is it semi real to life? Like, uh, is it, yeah, uh, it's actually so that's downtown LA in front. Of, I mean, it's not as big as it can be, but oops. but from what I understand, so that, I think this company is uh, European. Um, so I think it is as accurate a, ver- a representation of the U.S. as they can get from like pictures and things like yeah. that. Mm. Uh, probably like Google Maps. So. so it is a created environment. It's n- it's not actually how the roads really work. I would say it's probably so. like eighty percent accurate. Yeah. <laughs> From what, I, to, from what there I there we go. We're going on the interstate here, so uh, we got to merge. We got to merge in. Oh god! Oh god! Sorry, it's coming in, dude. There's a truck in front of you. What are you doing, homie? Move. He's just staring. He's just cold. Like, oh, oh sucker! <laughs> Sides what? Oh, I got a vehicle offense. I paid 150 bucks. Oh man, You're fine. Whatever. That guy got out of that easy. Like, he, yeah. All, all he did was just stop and like. Go, oh, wow, that, that was the thing that happened. Yeah, that was the truck. When you see a truck trying to merge onto the goddamn interstate, well, you speed up. So the AI in this, that's one of the complaints I have, is, uh, I'm speeding again. Um, one of the complaints I have is that, like, it's not normal merge. Like, normally when you see a truck or somebody getting on, uh, you get over it out of its way, right? So, like, sometimes, that's standard some e- That's, do. like, standard etiquette, though. Like, for the most part, that's standard etiquette. So... Your speed. So you keep saying you're speeding. So I know a lot of these. in the bottom in the bottom right. I use the digital one, not the analog one. Yeah, but I know a lot of these trucks are like slated for like a certain amount, and like I feel like you know you going sixty is not shouldn't be considered like. Uh, so the fifty five you see in the bottom of my GPS down there in the bottom right Uh is the truck speed. Cars can actually go I think ten mile an hour or higher than that, which is very annoying. Well, I know that trucks can get anywhere up to like seventy, like but most are slated for like that fifty five. We're just gonna put on cruise here. I'm just gonna cruise. I think. I think I set cruise. We're about to find out. This is a very therapeutic game, though. Like, it's really just... It's real uh, pretty. I and mean, surprisingly, yeah. Like, it's not, like, maybe the, the, the highest resolution textures or anything like that, but there's a there's a, a lack of pop-in. And uh, these are on the... I'm playing on the highest setting, so I'm playing on Ultra. Oh, God. My name's Keegan. I can run things on Ultra. No, I'm, I'm just saying... Because like, I have is, a computer. This is as pretty as it's going to get. Hi, Copper. How's it going? Uh, so, most people, as far as I understand it, <clears throat> most people dislike driving long distances, correct? I love driving long yeah, distances. Yeah, I do too. 
Like, I, I think... So, I, I guess we're not most people. I, mean, I think it's millennials, then. I read something recently about people that uh, were less and less happy about using cars because no one really actually likes driving was was what I got. I don't know, my, my dad's always been the one who primarily, like, whenever we went on a family trip, uh, my dad was always the one who uh, primarily ooh, 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 careful. I would love this game in VR because it's really hard to keep your awareness when you like look to the side. So that would be kind of nice. But yeah, my dad would always be the one who would drive everything. So, like, I don't know. Maybe. Do you guys like driving in the comments? Let all us know I'm, what you think about long distances. Is, I'm on the road again. Things will never be the same. So, so Keegan, questions in terms of gameplay. Uh, I got some answers for you. How, how does how does it feel? Like, does it feel like there's a good amount of heft behind the truck? Like, do you have to like hold down the button a little bit longer to turn, as opposed to like maybe another racing game or something like that? Oh shit! I'm getting off. Sorry, I was not paying attention. Uh, oh, that sounds like a personal problem. Wait, am I not getting off? Do I need gas? It says it said to get off, so I'm gonna I guess I'm gonna pick up some gas here. Uh, to answer your question, I guess I don't need gas. Um, there is so the different. Uh, here, let me. Why I'm, I'm stopped. This is a safe time you have to, to do get it. gas too. Uh, so you can see we got truck damage, trailer damage. We've got what we're carrying. Accessories: forty-three thousand pounds. Where we're going, the time they expect it, how much uh, time remains, and the rest stop and all that. Drive for four come. hours. Um, but, but to answer the original for, question, for heft, for like, well, I was saying like <laughs> uh, my, the reason I showed that was each trailer has like weight to it. Ah. And the answer is. The truck feels good, but everything feels the same. Old so they the all feel, feel heavy. The they all. F oh god! Oh god! Ah! Oh, Why would you stop there? Just a love tap. No, he didn't even. Dude, horn him! I did. Horn him again. Who stops at a goddamn merge? Hey, he did. He did crash. I can't even drive, and I mad apparently at this I. Guy. Cr oh, I crashed the car. Oh god, truck! <laughs> I crashed the car behind us. Uh, That's not my fault. I can't, you cannot, oh, I get a visit service apparently. Uh, you cannot blame me for that one. Let's uh, give a car yeah, stop. To, those clouds in the background look nice. Uh, question number two about gameplay. So we stopped but at a gas station. Yes. Can you pick up uh, the lot wizards as they call them? Or no. uh, ladies of the gas station? No. So it's an unrealistic Yeah, so this game. this game, unrealistic, one out of ten. <laughs> one out of ten. <laughs> IGN. Oh, it's, Something real cool with this game, though. So right now, um, the map is just uh, California and Nevada. They are. They said they're releasing Arizona uh, here soon. Oh, God. And then they are going to hopefully keep continuing with the U.S. And then mods, obviously, will open up anything because this is a PC I feel game. like you could probably mod this to be really hyper-realistic looking. Oh, yeah. same as you they could do add those yeah. oh, there, And, and I'm, I'm going to tell everybody now, I'm playing on, uh, on automatic because shifting, fuck that. <laughs> But you can do it with realistic, like they have like five different sets of shifting, and you can use retarders and, and all this kind of the, stuff. It's crazy. The the more s tenured of a truck driver you are, the more you like. They don't really like automatic, from what I understand. Like yeah. they mostly are doing manual. Uh, and I was reading that like there's one guy uh, who said he doesn't even ever start in first gear. He just always switches to third, yeah. and that's when he starts his cars like in third, which is nuts to me. The idea that like uh, driving this big of a thing, you're straight gunning it right away. You know, if I didn't get get off to not get gas, I would I would not have crashed into anybody. That's okay. I blame I blame the gas as far. Uh, question the third: Are there ever pirates of the highway that try to uh, commandeer? Uh -oh, my engine malfunctioned. Uh, <laughs> uh, is it AA? The engine triple A. Double A. Triple A. Call both of them. You're a trucker. AA you is uh, Alcoholics Anonymous. <laughs> I mean, you could be an alcoholic. I imagine that... My I engine... So right there, my engine literally just stopped. Oh, good. Like, it just cut out. But now it's back again, so we're going to see if we can make it. Realism! Yeah. Uh, it's a thing that happens. But what was your question, Jordan? I totally... Uh, are there... It was a pirates. stupid question. Are oh, there pirates. Are there pirates no, that but, maybe try to commandeer your But there, there are, there are uh, police cars, if you haven't noticed. There's been a few cop cars. Uh, engine malfunction. Screw it. I'm just going to push on. Uh, and if you're near a cop car, that's the only time you get caught for speeding, which is real cool. Like, if, if there's not a cop around, I'm speeding. They don't they don't catch me. But if there's one around, there So do you be. get tickets? Like, do they actually pull you over and you have to stop no, to the side? No, that would be cool, though. But so no, they, you just, just, they get just, get, you just get fined. Kind of like when we ran into that truck there, and it's like, you just got a fine for crashing into vehicles. Question number four. Is that three uh, or four? Can you actually ram people off the road? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, they they awesome. actually you guys saw we didn't record it but can you exit? Uh, I, I had a jackknife 
uh, truck in the middle of the interstate and cars just kept running into me at one point. So I see like a bed and I see stuff like that. Do you have to, so like, do you have to sleep after a certain amount of time? Yes. So you do get tired and the on, the on noise in this is actually really, really good. Like it sounds like, I, was, I play this with headphones usually Yeah. and it sounds like I'm yawning and I've actually questioned myself before. <laughs> like... <laughs> Keegan has existential crisis. Did, did I just yawn? Keegan really lives. It's, the, no, it's the real. Like it's really shocker. good. Like, uh, are know. you? Able, do you? Uh, but there, you have to. You have to. You have to uh, sleep every so often, especially on longer hauls. Is that service uh, station down there, like the green gas thing? The, yeah, no, I need a repair shop versus a service station. But it wants me to turn right here, so I'm going to do that. So we're going to get off. Uh, I'm going to signal. Even well, it looks like it. that's our destination. Maybe. No, destination. I'm going to the right. No, I mean, like, uh, there's that flag thing right there. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's where we're going. We picked a nice short haul. Wow. Oh. Anxiety. Because I'm that guy. <laughs> well, there's probably cars coming from the left. Screw it. We're going to go around them. Nope, no, Keegan, you already lost us money. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. You scared him. You are terrible. You are ruining... There's get... nobody... Okay, there is something. You are ruining Get in the Van LLC. You're ruining our reputation. Do we have one? We are never going to meet any ladies in our cool van if you keep on running into people. That could have been a van full of hot college co-eds. <laughs> I doubt it. I don't... I mean, and, and that's why you're going to ruin our company. Why is the speed limit 55 on here? Is this still a highway? Look at that motel. Probably. So okay. do you have to, like, stop at a motel to rest and... Motels, rest areas, um, all that kind of stuff. Sleep in a van. Do you well, know if you have a sleeper, you can, but you have to be on a safe... Sp spot on the side of the road. A safe spot? Yeah, like you can't, just stop, you can't just stop in the like, middle of the road. Yeah, you have to be back on the, like the a shoulder. Pull -off. What yeah. happens if you do? Uh, you get tired and you have more more chance of crashing. Let's stay in the lane. Oh, really? Yeah. So like the, then, the like longer screen, you don't your, sleep, your, your like screen, it starts getting weird? Your screen goes black. It starts going black and you just can't see. Cool. I mean, you can continue to drive, but at some point you cannot con You're gonna continue to You're going to fall asleep at the wheel. And also you got a workstation right here. Fresno. We discovered Fresno. Hi, Fresno. Hey, Fresno. Fresno, California. Level 2 gaming well, the here. Good, the good news is that this is not our uh, Are you going to turn right to that workstation? No, because this is not our truck. Oh, God, i got to stop, though. <laughs> Why wouldn't you stop the, at the workstation? There's a cop right there, too. <laughs> There's a cop right there. Why wouldn't you stop at the workstation with... Because uh... this is not our truck. We don't have to pay for it. We just oh. give it to them. We just get, it just gets taken out of our paycheck. When Sorry, we fucked your truck up. Peace. Yeah, pretty much. Well, yeah, but I mean, I'm just saying, like, if it keeps on... What if it dies and then we can't deliver our booty? We're almost there. It hasn't died yet. Chicken's making a calculated trucker call. Yeah. Right All right. I mean, I guess you you have lived the trucker lifestyle longer than I, I have, have by 112 minutes, according to Steam. Yeah, according to Steam, it's been a, it's been almost two hours of trucker. So what are, what are people watching this video? What do you guys think about simulators like this, like real life simulators? I call them, where it's just kind of you're doing the most fucking mundane thing I can think of. Um, but there's a whole video game built around it and purely around the realism of it. Like, this isn't really like GTA where you can be cutting corners and kind of, you know, running red lights. Like, you're supposed Why? to I, indicate. That's pro so that's the problem I have with the AI is they stop for me, which is dumb. They sh like, that guy should just keep going. <laughs> I mean, I, I appreciate it because I can go, but he shouldn't stop there. I, and, and to like, answer your question, at least from something out of, like, you know, Red, is that most people who actually do the job that you're simulating... Oh, hate playing these see. simulation games. <laughs> um, like, I know there's, like, farm simulators, and, like, pigs are shitty animals, and, like, they will kill you, and pigs are, you know, cute, cuddly things in the farming simulators. And, like, you know, I'm sure that, you know, this... I thought pigs were supposed to be really kind of smart. Like they dogs. are, but they know how to kill you. Like, and they're mean. How is a pig going to kill you? Uh, by eating you. Wow. Pigs, are, pigs are strong. Have you watched Hannibal? Yeah, but I mean that was like a dead body disposal technique. That wasn't uh, yeah. You like, cut some attack pig. You cut some. You cut some of that meat up though, and then you throw, toss them into a pig den, and those pigs. I don't think all chomp pigs are inherently Go. carnivores. Come on, engine. I See? think all pigs are inherently mean. Is from See? what I've understood our from like. Orange and held out. Seen the videos of the tweet little pigs running around. Well, sure, little piglets. I think are fine. We made it. It's before they come. Before killers. it's like how it's like how <laughs> kittens are cute until they become cats, and then as soon as they uh, become cats. They're Very shitty. Yeah. We made what? it. Why is it not collecting it? Uh, do you have to park? No, it it would tell you. The only thing that's great all you the didn't time fix the truck. is a dog. Yeah. Dogs no start off that. great as puppies, that. and then they get better the as a dog. Keegan? What? Do you have to go all the way in? You gotta go all the way in, Keegan. You usually just gets to right where it gets to the trailer. But let's find out. No? Try to park. 
No, because this normally pops up like, hey, how do you want to park? Do you want to park? That's one of the things I like about this game is like, do you want to be like me and just do it real easy? Or do you want to do a real complicated one? Look at that. Look at that Yui. I just jackknifed. Maybe if I go this way? Just let me collect it, please. I'm here. I'm at the flag. <laughs> you got to fix your truck, man. The red thing's telling you to leave. The root is, is saying... There we go. The Apparently I was not... So how am I going to truck park this? Am I going to do it... So you can see you get more experience based on how difficult the parking job is. Uh, so I where do you need it? Play it safe or sorry. I want to see where do you need it. The where most do you need difficult it? one. Yep, I want to see oh, you fuck this up. It's <laughs> going to happen. So i got to proceed to the unloading area. So you can see I probably have to, I have to pull a Yui again. Because, you know, this doesn't let me go the other way. Just back up like a real trucker. Close your Big eyes. Big mother trucker. So yeah, you just keep going backwards. Just keep going back and straight. Close your eyes. Smoke a cigarette. Just, get, just smoke some weed. Where are you going? Do a Hail Mary. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going. That's the problem. I think you need to go to the right, right there. You need to go right there. Because I got to park it in there. Yep, if so. I've learned anything from this simulator so far, it's that driving a truck is hard. Yeah. It really is. So I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to swing it around. And at any point, I can push enter and skip this. But I'm going to do this. Oh, so you have to reverse it. Oh, yeah. I guess yep. you got to reverse into it's it. It's a trailer. I mean, that's yeah. That, that made sense to me. Uh, once I asked that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Back into your own truck. This is going really good so far. Well, if I can get it straightened out. So I'm, I'm somewhat straightened out. Does your truck not have wheels in the middle? No, a lot of, oh, some of those beds don't. It really? might have some. Oh, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way! Oh my god. Well, it's hard when you go backwards because, like, the wheels the opposite direction of what you think it should be. On the bus, they, they go round and round for everyone. <laughs> Forever, forever. Into my soul, until they, until the treads break. Like my soul. Like, like my soul. <laughs> and then, and then you are no more. You can do this, Keegan. I have so much faith in you right now. This is probably the most faith what? I've ever had in you. All right, I'm slowly. That's dwindling. You got it. You got it. Just stick it in there. Bye. There should be like that uh, dude there that's cleaning the garage. Like he should be there, kind of waving. Like, yeah, him. come for it. Come for it. Hey, you fuck! Get over here! I would love that. <laughs> He's from New York as well. Woo, look yeah. how close I am to that wall. I get it, we're in L.A., but... Where are you going? I turned a little too sharp, Jordan, okay? Ooh. I'm gonna get this. We, watch this be late because I can't park. Here, what I'm gonna pull is, up in here. Join us next time. <laughs> on <laughs> Keegan, Keegan to park. This is our Let's Play of, uh... Here we go. American Ready? Truck Simulator, where Keegan tries to park for six episodes. So All right. I need to get my wheel straight. Wheel, you go straight. I kind of want the guy to start yelling abuse at you. Like, what the fuck are hey, you doing Hey, you fucking here? dick, what the fuck you doing? Hey, get over here. Stupid Swede. Because he's from Ikea. Fucking Ikea. <laughs> we got a shipment of TVs coming in. This fucking prick can't fucking Screw park it. the car. <laughs> God well, damn. It's I mean, all that flat pack shit. <laughs> I seriously can't do this. Can you just, like... Drop it in a jet. Is this the accuracy you used to fuck your mother? God damn. <laughs> you ever gotten it in a hole? Shit. Problem is my trailer's not straight. Yeah, that is a the, problem. The people, people on YouTube make this look real good. Real easy, the videos I watch of this. Well, you're not going far enough back. I know, that's a, but I can't. Cut like, the other my, way now. Cut my vehicle's the other way. jacked up. I can't. Oop. Well, go so go straight again. <laughs> I'm, tr I'm, 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 I'm trying. All right, there you go. Right, stop. All right, so you, you just keep going straight. And now just kind of slowly back up while going straight. Like, don't cut your... No, see, my trailer's not straight yet, though. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, so back up a teensy bit and then cut it in the opposite direction that your trailer is going. Cut. I can't. The trailer just keeps going. God damn it. Fuck it. You're getting there. You're getting there. <laughs> there you go. Kind of. We ran into a truck, so. Can you, like, look in the back? I'm going to do this. I, I feel can, like you're getting there. I can actually pull out here. There here we go. go. And then just drive the other way home and just pretend that this whole thing never happened. <laughs> I am so embarrassed, guys. <laughs> I cannot deliver this. Oh, Let oh, me try oh. this one more time, guys. I'm just gonna go back and come back again, and then we'll try this again. Can we load from the last checkpoint? Hold on. 
Keek, I have so much faith in you right now. I really can't see around the corner, though, is the problem. Oh, nope. that's a wall. I want to hit enter and just end this. Can I end this misery, please? No, you have to park it before we end the episode. That's it. <sighs> you know how long we're going to be here, Tom? That's mm-hmm. fine. You know how much space I have on this hard drive? <laughs> Beep. Terabytes, Keegan. I have terabytes. So, uh, so overall... Real hard to park a truck. Real yeah, hard. But, I mean, like, if this, so if this was... Whenever this is five dollars or one dollar or whatever, <laughs> like I'll, pay, I'll buy that. I will dollar. buy this motherfucker and I will play this in will, between bouts of XCOM. I will. I will play it never because it is stupid. <laughs> See, I love these kind of type of games. I swear, I'm I'm decent. I can do like the simple part, but I can't do the complicated. What part. kind of simulator would you play then, Tom? What kind of simulator? If there was like a simulator that you were like, all like right, a realistic simulator. Yeah, that is my shit right there. That is exactly the kind of simulator Ooh, I have always wanted to I play. That'd be tough. I-, I wouldn't want to do any kind of vehicle-based simulator. Like I Gigolo think... simulator. What now? Like Gigolo simulator? Uh, no. I did uh, it? <laughs> maybe like <laughs> reasonable. reasonable. Maybe like a realistic like drug dealer simulator, right? All right. So all right. like I say realistic, like you you genuinely have to like watch for the cops, come up with methods to avoid detection, and you know designate runners and and come up with new ways to get your stuff. You know that kind of that kind of a simulator, like something that is realistic and happens in real life, but is not necessarily something I'm ever going to get a chance to do. All right, I can see that. All I feel right. like this is just like if you got a truck. You could do this. Yeah. You know? And it would be fucking miserable. Oh, yeah. Awful. I mean, you, have, you do have to get, you know, your licensing and everything like oh, that. Oh, yeah. I mean, you, there's... There, I'm not I'm not saying Chuck oh. aren't, aren't talented, because fuck if I could do it. But at the same time, super boring. I mean, I think most truckers would say that it's a pretty boring life. So, I uh, actually want to be a trucker at one point in time, but clearly... That's not I the career am so field. glad you not the career not field I should go into. Did you park the fucking truck? I wasn't paying attention. Did you park? He not, d- not the right way, but he parked it. <laughs> he did get it in there. All right, so how how, how long is this one? 165? This, this is a short trip. Dude! Dude, that's red! That's green for me. Fuck you. All right, so we'll we'll go ahead and we'll get you us to yeah, our destination, and then we'll call this one. Okay. At least it's pretty scenery. You know, LA. Yeah. So but if it was like Russian truck simulator, that wait, would be that's sick. called Euro, that's called Euro truck that would simulator. Be like that does exist. Euro truck si- comrades, you cannot <laughs> park car. Russia truck drive you. So should I stay at this view or should I go uh, back? Into uh, the truck? I don't know. What's you like driving the most? You like doing first person or third person? Real hard to see in first person, but yeah, it's true. It is. I feel like first person is more realistic. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Was real hard to see. I so what, did you guys oh, play hey, GTA Five after they made the first person mode? Uh uh-uh. Yes. It's great. Like, it's really, really great. I just want to put that out there, because... Oh! Hey! Okay. As um, I go through. Oh, what <laughs> the, the original game uh, in, you know, regular GTA mode or whatever. Yeah, that was what I played on PS3. And, yeah, I played on PS3, and I really liked it. And then, when it came out PS4, I was like, eh, can they really make me buy it again? And, honestly, first person is a whole different ball game. Like, it's so it is. interesting to be able to play that type of a game in first person. I'm so glad they did it. And from what I understand, it runs pretty solidly, doesn't oh, it? Oh, great. Yeah, absolutely. But even, like, the gunplay... No! Tight. Uh, very good. Oh, hi, truck. <laughs> wow, you <laughs> could not have botched that any I hit, harder. I hit the wrong button. I went. To, I meant to hit the turn button. I hit the turn my head button. Yeah. That was your first mistake. <laughs> yeah, so, like like I said earlier, if this was in my VR... My car that I just fucked up. <laughs> if this was in VR... This is a BMW. This would be so much, e- this would be so much easier. Like, cause or you would just it? turn. Well, yeah, because you have your mirrors, you just turn your head. I just, you lose your spatial awareness when you do something like this. I'd like to see him spice it up a touch. Have, like, some hitchers and stuff, you know? You, Ooh, yeah, and then good, one of the right? hitcher might be a murderer. Yeah. You know, if you pick Excuse up the Excuse me, green light. Beep, beep. Game over. Or you have to figure, like, talk your way out of that person murdering you. Like, you, it's not necessarily a game over situation. Like, you still could. But what you need oh, to God. do is get, the same thing again. is get the knife out of his hands. Oh, God. <laughs> You're doing good. There well, be, again, I keep pushing the wrong... There would be, just be two options when you pull up next to the hitcher. Just, like, you can select weed or head. <laughs> okay, we're Ash or grass. We're Ash, up, Ash grass or cass. So, yeah, I was going to be a trucker back in the day. Yeah? You, uh... What would your call sign have been? Uh, probably my screen name. 
Monkey Maniac. Would have been some. Yeah, uh, Monkey Maniac <laughs> here. Uh, Actually, some, Monkey Man probably. Some prime choice lot wizards here. They're definitely disease free. Oh, that's a nice. Uh, monkey Man. The trucker. Monkey man, the trucker. <laughs> I kind of wish that happened. I'm sorry. Could you have a giant monkey face on the front of your grill? <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> Are you? You have the windshield wipers going just on, on the off chance it rains. Yeah, I'm turn sky. my lights on just to be safe. That's good. What would your so if Monkey Man is your coal sign? What would your business be? What would be the business name? Monkey Man LLC. That's what? boring. Come on, you can do better. Bananas Inc. Do you call me boring for naming Tom? Shit flingers LLC. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because somebody would hire you with that. I would hire him. Hey, you're the monkey man. Yeah. It makes sense. Am I turning right or left? Am this guy's sure? buying into his shtick real hard. I like it. His Yelp review says that... I really that liked it until he flung his shit at me. <laughs> Yelp review, 1 out of 10, says that he flings shit. Engine malfunction. Ah! Your engine malfunctions a lot. Yeah. Yeah, it's because I don't know how to drive. That's true. I feel like, uh... My hazards are on, though. I hit the wrong button. I feel like if it, your engine malfunctions that frequently, you should probably see a doctor about it. <laughs> You we're might have engine dysfunction. We're going to get back on the, uh, the interstate. Careful, here. there's another truck! King it! Whee! Oh, God. Too fast, too fast. Oh, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> That's not the street. I got it. Nailed it. There you go. What's the deal with turns? Oh, oh God. You turn over some signs. <laughs> Your car is going to be like... You're going to deliver no it in... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah! Go. Thank you. Oh, that was close. <laughs> it's a good thing that's close. Keegan, you're yeah. giving me... A, like, you're going to give me an... Anxiety. I attack. forget. So I'm watching this when we were recording this. I'm watching this on my iMac in a window version. They're watching the full screen version. I'm sure it's way, way different, way more terrifying. Oh. It's interesting. God, I remind me never to drive with you. In I've real life, I've driven before. He's terrible. Nah. He sings fucking Frozen songs while he's driving <laughs> with no go. hands on the fucking steering wheel. I might add. Well, see, at the end of the song, though, I said I said I, said I should probably put my hand back on the wheel. After an entire song, yes, you realize <laughs> I should put my hands back on the steering. We're wheel. just gonna cruise now, so that means I just have to steer. Did you guys ever play Cruising USA or any oh, of those N sixty four racing games? Rings a bell. Well, Cruising US USA was also a uh, arcade game. Yeah, those are good games. Yeah, I, it's like I I'm USA. older than that. I played Outrun. Uh, I, I, run, yeah. I don't know what that yeah. is. I uh, I've never the, the only car game I've ever actually enjoyed to the point where potentially I would buy it Project again cars. was Burnout Three. Uh, Burnout's good. I Dude, like Burnout the Takedown. Midnight Club series. Um, I played those and I kind of like them, but not enough to buy another one. Oh, actually, no, I tell a lie. There is one other game that I would fucking love it for it to make a comeback, and I've been asking for it for years now. Is uh, Road Rash. Yeah. Road Rash would be fantastic I'm with the new console What do you, what do you guys think about the Criterion? The, well, I guess not Criterion, technically. The former Criterion people making that golf game. Man, I'm pumped. Like that I don't like golf like games. Like a super but exploding golf. Like it's burnout with yeah. golf, is how they described it. Uh, there's a new Road Rage game coming out, I think it is, where you uh, actually like fight other drivers. Like Simpsons Road Rage? <laughs> uh, yeah, I said this is like a... Uh, like it's Road Rage Simulator? Yeah, it's uh, it was a, a game R that was on like SNES or Sega Genesis, I can't remember. Um, and they're redoing it, you know, 60 frames a second, 1080p, like upgradable weapon trees and stuff like that. Uh, oh, I guess they should totally running. do that with Road Rash, man. Road Rash was exciting. You had like enemies that you could like, like actual like nemesis. Yep. Um, you know, like chain whipping a motherfucker off uh, that you don't like off of their motorbike is one of the best things. It actually ever. might be Road Rash then. That might be what I'm. Well, they had one that was. They had a N64 version, I think. Road Rash 64. It was a piece of shit. But the the original Road Rash and Road Rash 2 were some of the best games racing wise that I've ever played. I mean, they were shitty graphics and everything. So I'm getting so, off on the, I, I mean, that's why, now. like, if you could make it with this this or higher graphic fidelity, but still have all the weapons and the nemesis system and things like that, oh my god, it'd be great. I'm getting I'm getting off now to go to Oxnard. Uh, yeah, it's actually Road Redemption is what it's called. Uh, they is a re it's a redoing of that whole entire franchise. Come on. Add on Steam. Go. Just run cars. Mm -hmm. It's called Road Redemption. Holy shit! And it's called a, bikes. Yep. Bikes and you have spiked bats that you can do and chains and nice. shit like that. Yeah, so well, that, I, was like, I thought that that was a, a game. Was that at? Uh, I think it's actually already out. I think it might be an early access. All right. Um, Going to Steam right now. Twenty bucks, I think. Yeah, it's a little heavy. Yeah, so it's still something what? to keep your eye on at least. Uh, I also really like Twisted Metal. Yeah. It's okay. I've never been the biggest Twisted Metal fan. 
Uh, I was a little sad. Uh, oh, layers of fear is that? Look at that. Yep. Um, I was a little sad when um, the big announcement of the E3 that one year was was that game. I was just like, eh. Well, yeah, Twisted Metal Black is still one of my favorite. Like that game is dark as fuck. Look at this lighting, by the way. I'm real. Yeah, why is pretty sunset. solid. Yeah, I mean, this isn't a bad looking game. I mean, let, I mean, if I was not, a better driver, it's not fantastic looking. Like there are definitely some weird texture things, but Poppin's been pretty solid. It's maintained a pretty consistent. I don't, this is probably like thirty frames a second. Yeah, uh, I I would love like it, once they open this up to theoretically be the whole United States. How cool would that be to drive from LA to New York? Yeah. That's right a pretty road, sense. for sure. Well, I should probably not take it at 55 miles an hour, though. Feels like It feels like it's getting dusky. Like It is. Yeah. The, the so, sun is setting. Yeah, so uh, it, d- it does actually get dark and shit? Yep. So that's when you hit the L key, and you turn lights on. Hmm. Do you have uh, brights? I do, and I don't know how to turn those on, Just though. careen through the darkness with your brights on? There is, a way to, there is a way to do that, but I don't remember... What the button is. When it gets really dark, can you tempt your fate and just turn off the lights and just <laughs> gun it? You can. Uh, it's real terrifying though. Like when it's when this game gets this game gets dark, like and just to the see point if where you, you can cheat. Not a lot of street lights uh, out in the desert, I guess. Nope. I have to imagine that like there are probably some genuinely terrifying things uh, about being a truck driver. Mainly, you're all alone most of the time. I mean, you're all alone. It gets dark out, and like you have to drive this. Two ton thing. Two ton. Two hundred ton thing. I was say, depending on how much your loads are usually about. Well, average load's probably about ten to fifteen. Yeah, I'd say two tons is really low. Yeah, I mean, so you have to drive <laughs> this twenty ton thing, and you know it's dark out. If there's ever ice, like you have to worry about that shit. And I know Let's that. Slow down. I'm going thirty miles or twenty miles an hour with the speed limit. And I know that weight of your car causes you not to hydroplane as much, and the amount of wheels that you have technically gives you more contact to well, the ground. So you have you ever watched the show Ice Road Truckers? Yeah, that looks terrifying. They, uh, they're one of the questions was like, how come you guys go so fast on the ice? Oh, stop! I'm going in here. On the ice roads, and it's because they weigh so much. Yeah. Which mm-hmm. makes sense. Yeah, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't have thought about that and trip for that show. So where am I dropping this off? Uh, I discovered Oxnard. Let's just do whatever's easiest. I don't yeah. know if I want to see you try you that a again? second time. Yeah, let's not do that again. Why can't I? It's it's here. it still doesn't let me pick it up. Do I have to do a loop? Because normally what it does when I pull through, it should grab it like right as soon as I hit it. Like as soon as my truck passes. What, what if you press like enter? You know it, it, pro- in, uh, it should prompt you though. Like, third right, person, make sure there you're it is. It right. So I'm gonna do play it safe. Because this way I just gotta pull in versus going reverse. That's fair. So I gotta go right there. I think I can handle that. I'm gonna laugh when we mess this up. <laughs> oh, the green star. Ah, oh, your lucky charms. Am I there yet? Hello? There we go. Oh, drop the trailer. Yeah! I did it. Good I job, Keegan. You were go- satisfactory. Yeah, I may have destroyed some cars. You're a one. satisfactory truck driver. Hey, we hit level, level two. Level one, sorry. Level one. Well, good job, Keegan. So that was uh, American Truck Simulator. I'm glad we uh, finally got to take a look at this, Keegan. Here, I'll show this real quick before we leave. This is the level up system. So as you go along, you can get like different things, and it gives you more money. So hazardous materials is probably my favorite one. Cause you can drive stuff that'll explode, um, but like when you're when you're a truck, like when you own the truck, fuel economy is important because obviously you gotta pay for fuel. Then sure, high value cargo is obviously important. That kind of stuff. So long distance is really cool because you can go real far. But yeah, uh, cool. It's a very interesting game. Like I said, if it's ever like a dollar, I'll pick this up. <laughs> it's a dollar. But, uh, I love it. That's such an insult. I love it though. Yeah, but I, I I definitely am intrigued by this, and I will. I am very glad that we finally got time to actually like, watch you play it, this. It was so. interesting. Yeah. I'll give you that. Uh, you know, not my thing, but at the same time, I am sure there are plenty of people out there, thousands and thousands of people, that this is the greatest thing on earth for them. I think that uh, getting the van LLC is. Uh... Hold on, we got before we go. We just got money to buy a truck. All right. So we All gotta right. make we gotta make make good on this. So. Uh... How much money we got? We got one hundred four thousand dollars. That's one hundred forty, so we can't buy that. They can't really buy anything. No. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> well, so much for that. But yeah, here's and some like of the trucks you can buy. True truck simulator. You're fucking broke. Yeah. All right. Even after we took out a loan. <laughs> yeah. Hundred thousand dollar loan. Still can't afford it. Tight. So, well, thanks yeah. for showing us this, Keem. That's uh, showing this to us as well. Uh, 
ATS, as the kids call it. As the truckers call it. Um, God, Henry looks so disappointed in himself. I mean, he did run into a lot of things. Oh, His okay. rating is zero. He's seen some shit, okay? <laughs> he has seen some shit. All right, well, uh, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, well, welcome, welcome to, to the, the second, second level. level. Bye, Bye, guys. Did you know how to Facebook? We didn't know how to Facebook. And then we met Keegan. Keegan knows how to Facebook. And Keegan made a Facebook, especially for level two. It actually has little to do with our YouTube channel and more so just a news source for you to check out the latest news and interesting tidbits on video games. If you want to check it out, there's probably a link somewhere around my head.